The Dominion has always had a strong leader. Stepping into my father's role was challenging, and I often relied on others to support me. As General Davis did, when the Defenders of Man began spreading disinformation about my response to the Zerg attacks. I take these allegations seriously. My administration has completed a thorough investigation of the Defenders of Man. The truth is, they used Psy emitters to incite the Pharaoh Zerg to attack. And they have executed unprovoked strikes on the Protoss as well. Our evidence is undeniable. The orders we recovered were issued by none other than General Carolina Davis. She is hereby under arrest and charged with treason against the Terran Dominion. I look forward to announcing the trial date shortly. Enemies outnumber us on both sides. We need more forces to hold this city against the Taldarim. Several defenders of man squadrons have contacted us, Emperor. It seems the lower ranks weren't aware of Davis's real agenda. Your speech opened their eyes, and they will fight the Taldarim with us. That's a start. We can rely on their outposts to hold the front line for a time, while we focus on getting our reinforcements ready. I'll join them. I can keep the Taldarim scattered on the edges of the city, away from our bases. We should also deploy liberators and siege tanks to strengthen our positions, and perhaps an SCV or two for repairs. You always think of everything, Rigel. We're going to need all of it to get through this. We'll be able to construct battle cruisers on our next mission, Nova. I've developed upgrades for them. If you're interested. have declared that Vardona is in a state of emergency after Protoss forces began attacking the planet. Emperor Valerian and several high-ranking officials are caught in the crossfire. The Emperor was revealing evidence against the Defenders of Man and their alleged leader, General Davis, when the Protoss struck. Enemy forces are moving down the central streets in these locations. 
Additionally, I've summoned the Dominion fleet to help us, but it'll be some time before they arrive. Once they're here, our battle cruisers will have no problem blasting through the Taldarim. Until then, you've been cleared to build your own. We already have the plans. First, we must construct a fusion core. Then the ships themselves will require a vast number of resources. Never thought beating Alarak would come cheap. Alderim immortals are advancing on our position. They'll carve through our forces unless we stop them. Leave it to me. side streets. The Taldarim will probably strike these areas soon. Your support would be welcome, Nova. My scans show Taldarim void rays gathering for an attack from the left. I'll cut them off. Thanks, Rigel. Aldarim's attacks are intensifying. Our outer defenses won't last unless we permanently station reinforcements there. Should the perimeter fall, the Protoss attack forces can converge, and we'll have a hell of a fight on our hands. They'll also destroy the Dominion Research Center in this vicinity. I heard they were on the verge of a breakthrough. Not enough. I'll do my best to keep it 
Enemy void rays are flying in from the right side. Nova, why are you helping these vermin? There are innocent people here. You already know that. You just don't care. What's going on? First squadrons in the Dominion fleet have arrived, and will begin supporting our defenses. Our Gorgon-class battlecruisers are particularly effective against heavy resistance. Give the call, and I'll command them to clear an area. Approaching the central entrance to our base. Call down a Gorgon if you can, Nova. Walkers are coming in from the left side. Upgrade complete. are moving to intercept our forces.
remainder of the Dominion fleet has reached our position, Emperor. At last. Ensure they fill in the weak points in our defenses. You should also transfer General Davis to one of the brigs. She must be kept under maximum guard, no matter what happens. Of course. I'll see to it. Even for a Terran. Janara. I guess Alarak won't fight his own battles. So, but there are still more Taldarim attacking. Our fight has not ended. Nara is leading the rest of the Death Fleet toward us, Nova. We'll finish this. One way or another. Dream casualties are high. We've forced them to accept defeat. There were losses on our side as well. Recall our ships, Horner. We need to get back to Korhal. One of the ships isn't responding. The Medusa. They had Davis in custody there. My scans show the Medusa has already left orbit. Then she escaped. 
Return to your ship, Nova. We have much to discuss.